and a lot of our us viewers who like to watch reality shows uh, were really hoping that this would be that show that didn't get messy because it didn't start off that way. You know, it gave us a lot of hope to um, put uh, young professionals on a platform to show the positive side of African-Americans making changes. And then all of a sudden it just went to the, to the left. <laughs> yeah, no, right to the left, to the left, yeah. everything's going in the back. Yes. The oh, okay. <laughs> it, wasn't supposed, it wasn't supposed to be that way. Yeah. You know, it was supposed to, you know, just speaking for, for Melody and Martell based on what I knew when, when they decided to do the show. Um, because I had found out maybe about uh, three months before the show was picked up that there had been some infidelity. So when the show was picked up, you know, my thing to, and you know, they seemed to have been getting over it. They was working past it. So my conversation with both of them was, look, you guys need to make sure that your relationship is strong and solid now. Because if you sign on for this show, it's gonna have to be strong and solid to stand. Oh, we're good, we're good. We got it together, we got it together. And, you know, um, Martel told us some stuff that we believed. You know, he convinced me that it was good. And, um, you know, to continue to do something like that and think it's not gonna come out eventually. I don't know what the thinking was behind that, but that's how the show went a different way because it was supposed to show, yes, they experienced that in their marriage. They got past it, they moved on and their relationship was stronger yeah. and they continued to build their legacy. And that would have been nice. Um, I remember when the two of them uh, came to visit me here at the radio station before the first season started. They did a uh, Christmas special with me. And it was at that time that I, you know, I just asked, you know, and, and before they left, uh, I, I don't know if Mel remembers this, but I said, please don't let this show be the reason you all break up, you know. And uh, I got the famous melody, oh, Tony. <laughs> right. right. So, um, yeah, unfortunately, things did uh, sour and, and go in a d different direction. And um, hey, here we are. But, you know, and, and I've heard her say this, and I believe it to be true. The show didn't break up her marriage. OK. <laughs> the actions that continued. So it the show didn't break up the marriage, but it did put it on a platform and it magnified the issue to the world. Well, my thing is, if everyone in your circle knows mm -hmm. who are the people that you're closest to whose opinion matters, right? who cares what the world knows or think? Okay. You know? Yeah. And, and apparently a whole lot of people knew a whole lot of stuff and was Ooh. keeping a whole lot of stuff from Melody. Okay. You know? So... I yeah. started hearing rumblings and I don't talk to a lot of people. I mostly talk on this microphone. <laughs> and um, and I think that by the time I heard anything, it was already pretty much out on television. Um, and, um, you know, I just wanted to ask Melody herself if what I was hearing was true, you know, because right. um, I don't like to, as much as T-Mill and I like to gossip a little bit on our show, we don't like to get into the, the gossip for real.